les prometo que viviré con ustedes, que lucharé con ustedes y que venceré con ustedes para seguir haciendo realidad el sueño del socialismo, de la revolución bolivariana. Come from? Uh, uh, so I'm Duarte and I'm from the Portuguese National Preparatory Committee uh, of the festival. Okay. Uh, how is this political situation in, in Portugal? Uh, now in Portugal, uh, the Portuguese youth is uh, being under a great attack uh, that comes uh, from the right-wing policies that are being implemented uh, between uh, in, in what we call an aggression pact made by this uh, uh, this government uh, with the, uh, uh, the help of uh, IMF, European Union, and the um, bank, uh, European Central Bank, and so this attack uh, is re reflected uh, on uh, education. For instance, uh, a lot of students needing to, uh, force, being forced to go um, outside the, the university because they have no money to pay uh, the very high tuition fees because there is no scholarships. And also, um, uh, like in a uh, strategy of uh, gentrifying and uh, privatizing education. Also, uh, the, in the work, uh, in uh, young workers, uh, they are also under a great attack. So there is a lot of unemployment. For instance, 42% uh, of uh, youth unemployment, official data. And uh, also, uh, precarity, a lot of uh, young workers being um, uh, without any stable uh, conditions of life because they have, they can be fired anytime. And also the low salaries that are really, uh, this, all these issues forcing uh, thousands of uh, Portuguese youngsters to go uh, to forced immigration. Like, in one year we had 200,000 uh, people, Portuguese people, mainly youngsters, that uh, needed to go to immigration because they have uh, no future in Portugal. And this is uh, like a policy that is uh, uh, this right-wing policy that's really destroying our country. So unemployment, the lack of national production, destroying uh, industries, destroying agriculture is like what the European Union wants in Portugal and what is being applied. It's really destroying our country, uh, the perspectives of the youth. And so this is uh, really a situation that we must uh, struggle against. How was the general strike that took place a few days ago? Uh, yes, uh, the, in 27th June there was a, a big general strike in Portugal that was uh, called by the class trade union CGTP um, and the, uh, we make a, a balance as this was like a great, uh, a great general strike. It has been made in a response uh, of these measures of the government uh, against uh, public services, trying to destroy the public services and also the uh, authentic rob to the to the workers and to to the Portuguese people, and so it has been uh, with a generalized um, um, support from from the Portuguese workers. The adhesion to the um, to the strike was really big, and we think that uh, this is uh, uh, the youth is also has also participated in this uh, strike, mobilizing, being in the enterprises, in call centers, uh, many enterprises where. Uh, uh, the um, bosses want to impeach the workers of their right to uh, to strike, and so uh, this was really a great moment of uh, uh, really confrontation against this government, uh, against these policies for a new policy. Because we really think that uh, uh, if this continues, these policies of the right wing and these policies uh, of European opinion, and we have a, uh, we will really make big uh, uh, steps behind uh, and really um, dis destroy even more uh, that situation in our country. Uh, what are your expectations about the festival? So uh, about the festival in Portugal, uh, we are preparing uh, with a lot of enthusiasm this festival. We think that uh, there are all the conditions to, to have a great uh, festival in Ecuador. Uh, we have our National Preparatory Committee formed. We want to have a lot of different type of associations of youth organizations in this NPC in order to really bring the festival and its values to the Portuguese, peop uh, Portuguese young people uh, to uh, you know, 
make this uh, a festival known in the country and also to bring this uh, situation and all the struggles from the students, from the workers that has been in Portugal, to bring it that to Ecuador because we think it, uh, it's very important the, the festival as a moment where uh, the people from all the world with really different uh, experiences uh, from hundreds of countries that are really uh, in different uh, situations that uh, come and in that uh, in that event uh, can uh, exchange uh, ideas exchange uh, experiences and uh, be get uh, more strength to the struggle uh, against imperialism also to find that imperialism uh, uses many different uh, tools against the peoples and against the against the youth uh, but different tools but with the same objective that is uh, oppression exploitation and that really um, is uh, through the struggle of, of the of the workers of the people and of the youth that we will defeat imperialism and we think this festival will be a great opportunity for us to gather to get more strength and to uh, really make a step to defeat imperialism thank you very much. Uh, thank, thank you, you.